rookies and the here back with another OBS tutorial and yes you want to make your OBS look like this I've talked about themes in the past but this is a new one from CGC Dan and it looks beautiful get, get, get your OBS looking like my head you know what I'm talking about I'm gonna show you exactly how to do it all right stay tuned let's go for it put your rock over the stone Right, so to get started, you, you don't really need any like plugins or anything. You just need to download a theme that is available on the OBS website. As you can see just here, the link is in the description below. So don't worry about the link or anything like that. It looks beautiful. This is apparently his first OBS theme that he's ever made. So if you think of any improvements or anything like that, just let him know, all right? So this dropped up the other day. So we're just going to go up to the right-hand corner there and press go to download. It's going to take us to a GitHub page just here. And we're just going to download download this zip file just there it's only it's less than a megabyte so it only takes a couple of seconds to download and then we're going to jump into your downloads folder and you'll see it just here cgc theme you don't even have to unzip it if you don't want to just go into the files uh, and then you'll see the obs underscore theme folder inside of here and then copy these two files as you can see the cgc file and the cgc.qs S. Then we're going to head over to where your OBS is. So mine's in C drive, then program files. Yours might be program files 86. Inside there, you should see OBS studio, all lowercase. Jump into there, and then we're going to go into data or data, and then OBS studio, and then themes. And you'll see all your different themes in here. As you probably see, I've got a couple in there. You can download more from the OBS website as well. I have covered them in previous videos. We're just going to right click in that folder and press paste once we do that mine's going to ask me if i want to replace it because i've already got it installed so i'm just going to press replace for now that's fine and it'll ask for all administrate uh, privileges all that jazz just say continue because you're, you're right into the c drive that's fine and it's all installed ready to go open up obs next so you can see i'm using the traditional theme in here we're going to go up to file press settings you don't even have to restart OBS if it's already open because it reads from the folder as we've got it open. And we're going to go to general and then to theme just here. Click on the drop down and you'll see CGC. So we're going to press that. It will take a couple of seconds. It will kind of glitch out a little bit whilst it's loading all the theme in. Thank you for that, Dexter. And then we can press apply. It'll take a second to just apply the settings and then we can press OK. Dexter's wanting to get on the, on the, on the video today, aren't you, mate? Dexter's down here waiting for a scratch. Press OK and we're all ready we're all on it proceeds through all your filter menus and stuff like that so the this theme is everywhere i'm just gonna look this is what i have to deal with every single time every single time i'm doing a video literally as soon as i start talking he's like oh playtime but that is pretty much all there is to it guys you can use different themes like this i absolutely love this theme uh, i think it looks just beautiful i love the whole pink purple vibe it just looks nice and it's not just for ladies all right it's for guys too i'm a guy i'm a guy and speaking of that only seven percent of my audience are female so uh, is there a lack of female streamers i don't know we need more of you let's go Let's go. All right, guys, put your rock over the stone. I'll see you in the next one. I just want to say a huge thanks to all my patrons that help make this content full time, make it free for you guys. And also a huge thanks to all my YouTube members. You, you guys are legends. Thank you so much for everything that you do for me and the community. Keep it up, guys.